Uncanny X-Men 185. The government is having a meeting about Rogue. Henry Gyrick talks about how much of a threat she is and that he's going to use Forge's power neutralizer on her. Raven Darkhome barges in and demands that they give her back the weapon. Val Cooper tries to calm her down and tells her that the order came from the president himself. Storm tells Professor X that Rogue has left the mansion. He and Storm go to locate her and Rachel decides to give Cyclops a call but she's too emotional to speak to him. Mystique tells Destiny what the government has planned for Rogue. She thinks it might help bring Rogue back to her but Destiny urges Mystique to consider the consequences. Mystique tells Forge about the plan and he's furious. Rogue is swimming and sunbathing in Mississippi when Storm shows up. They talk about Rogue's past and Rogue feels like she isn't making any progress in controlling her powers. Storm offers to be a test subject and Rogue absorbs her and she has fun playing with the weather. She's suddenly attacked and she tries to fly away but her powers are acting wonky. The government fires at her so she uses Storm's power to retaliate. A tugboat's in danger so she tries to soothe the weather but has trouble doing it until Storm comes to and helps her. Gyrick fires the neutralizer but Forge tackles him and he hits Storm. Forge berates Gyrick for stealing her powers and some dire rates declare that Forge must die.